This is the 2018 Math Kangaroo level 7-8 prom number 24. Simon and Ian decide to have a race. Simon runs around the perimeter of the pool shown in the diagram, while Ian swims lengths of the pool. Simon runs three times faster than Ian swims. Ian swam six lengths of the pool in the same time Simon ran around the pool five times. How wide is the pool? A. 25 meters B. 40 meters C. 50 meters D. 80 meters or E. 180 meters This is the problem as it appeared on the test. Here is the first solution. Let's start by noting that distance equals speed times time, which means that time is equal to distance over speed. As it states in the problem, Simon runs three times faster than Ian swims. Therefore, we can write the speed of Simon as being three times the speed of Ian. In the problem, it also states that Ian swam six lengths of the pool in the same time Simon ran around the pool five times. This means that Ian's distance is equal to six lengths, while Simon's distance is equal to five times the perimeter of the pool, the perimeter being two lengths plus two widths. Because the amount of time they spent doing those two distances is the same, we will get that distance of Ian over his speed is equal to the distance of Simon over Simon's speed. Now, we can rewrite everything that we have already stated into a new equation. Ian's distance, as we've already noted over here, is equal to six lengths over his speed must be equal to Simon's distance, which we have written over here, as being 10 lengths plus 10 widths over Simon's speed, which is also equal to three times Ian's speed. Now we can cross multiply and solve. And start by canceling out the speeds of Ian. And then we can cross multiply to get that 18 lengths plus is equal to 10 lengths plus 10 widths. Subtracting 10 lengths from e both sorry, from both sides, we will get that 8 lengths is equal to 10 widths. As we know from the problem, the length of the pool is 50 meters. If we plug that in here, we will get that 8 times 50 is equal to 10 widths, which means that 400 is equal to 10 widths, which means that the width is equal to 40 meters, which is answer choice B. Now we can go on to the second solution. Because the problem states, again, that Simon runs three times faster than Ian swims, we can say that if Ian swims six lengths in the same amount of time, Simon will run 18 lengths, as he is three times faster. As stated in the problem here, Ian swim six lengths of the pool in the same time Simon ran around the pool five times. That means that when Ian swims six lengths, this is equal to five times the perimeter of the pool, the perimeter being two lengths plus two widths. Now we can set these two values equal to each other over here, which means that 18 lengths is equal to 10 lengths plus 10 widths, 
Subtracting 10 lengths from both sides, we get that 8 lengths is equal to 10 widths. Now we can plug 50 in for the length of the pool, getting 8 times 50 being equal to 10 widths, meaning 400 is equal to 10 widths, meaning the width must be equal to 40 meters, which is answer choice B. Thank you so much for watching, and please like, comment which solution you like more, or if you have a different solution, and subscribe. Thank you.